allowing yourself to be moved and posed. Try all you like to open them, but find the more that you try, the more firmly they seem to want to keep themselves stuck shut now. Can you can you look at me when I'm talking to you, please? Hello. I'm over here. No. Yeah, what are you trying to want to? Now what you find is, as long as something is stuck to your nose, you can move other things away. But something always has to be stuck to your nose. Why are you you're looking at this? Why you don't know your name, your birthday? Why you can't speak away? So I am Sabrina. Hi Sabrina. Hello. <laughs> so I uh, work for a photography studio. Mm -hmm. Is that for someone else or yes. for yourself? Yes, uh, so for someone else. Uh, but I'm all self-employed with it all, so I have to do a lot of maths with bookkeeping, which is not good for someone who can't even remember how old they are. <laughs> I did ask that a minute ago. How old yes. are you? We've already done the maths off screen. We've already done the maths off screen, but that was like 30 seconds ago, which was a long time ago, and my short-term memory is like, you know. Uh, so, 28. <laughs> do you like the idea of getting less maths? Spell down, having your reality dictated by someone else for a while. I don't know. It's, it's, You're curious then. Yeah, I'm curious because it's nothing I've ever done before and, and it's it's something I'm very open to. It's, I mean, openness is important. Yes. So, <laughs> focusing on the flying, taking deep breaths and enjoying the idea of being enchanted for a while. Enjoying the idea of feeling spellbound, calm. Thoughts of your waking self taking a back seat, your responsibilities melting away. Easy to let your imagination start to wonder what it would be like to be enchanted and spellbound and sleepy and obedient. Let those sensations take over. The sleepy sensation, like your body is filling with relaxation, like your mind is slowing down, like your thoughts are slowing down. Recall a time when they've been very tired and very sleepy, you just wanted them out, you just let them close, or you just found that you could bear them open you know, when they wanted to close themselves. Recalling that time, that sensation. Let them close now for you, please. Let them close now. Find yourself feeling very relaxed and floppy and limp and loose, like you're a rag doll. Go ahead and lift the wrist and raise it. Don't work with me, just be that rag doll. Be floppy and limp and loose and sleepy. Let the hand go. Don't hold it up, just let it go. As I drop it, I feel it drop deeper. Drop down heavy. I can see there's that strong desire to work with me, which is fine because now we feel more like a poseable doll. Now, poseable doll, pretty and elegant. Poseable doll, mannequin like. Allowing yourself to be moved and posed. Allowing yourself to feel less like a person, more like a doll, more like a mannequin. With a snap of my fingers, I want you to become a rag doll again, relaxing as can be, and going limp as can be and dropping down deeper and deeper. He says moving the candle away, just to be on the safe side. And sleep, relax, drop. Dropping like a rag doll, go back in. Go back out, soothe and calm, spaced and comfortable, relaxed, content. Wide awake, my spellbound plaything. Hello. Hello. You there? Mm-hmm. Focused on every word like you want to do, exactly as I say, is that how we're feeling? Or... I don't know. What? <laughs> What do you see? Five fingers? Yeah, look at them. Aren't they magnetic? Aren't they enchanting? Are you not feeling enchanted? No. Oh. Mm, well, there's too many. Maybe they're too bad. You've been uh, tied up before, right? Mm hmm. And blindfolded before. Recall a time when you've been blindfolded where your eyes have been firmly stuck shut because you've got something covering them and you can't open them no matter how hard you try. I imagine that your eyelids are glued, fixed, locked, bound. Imagine that when I, when I use the word bound, whatever I talk about becomes bound and fixed and stuck in place. So, right now, eyes bound, eyelids bound, and no matter how you try to open them or force them or lift them, they just seem to grow more fixed, more heavy, more locked in place. Try all you like to open them, but find that the more that you try, the more firmly they seem to want to keep themselves stuck shut now. Trying, failing, trying to force them, find that. They grow more strongly, firmly fixed and shut. Waking, feeling loudly and refreshed, but your eyes staying firmly shut. In three, two, one. Wake, feeling fine. Hi. Hi. How are you doing over there? Okay. Do you not feel like looking at me? Am I? Am I not pretty enough? No. What? <laughs> uh, just your eyes. Released. 
Hello, everyone, just fine. But your hands don't seem to be moving very much. How, how are your hands right now? Can you make them go anywhere else? Can you make them go in different directions? Mm -hmm. That's strange. <laughs> the more you try, the more that they won't. The more that they don't, the more fixed that they are. Good. Find your feet are bound. Pounds before stuck in place. Could you walk over here for me? I've got I've got ten pounds I want to give you. How many you ten shiny pounds? Could you just make it over here for me? Now this way. Come come here, I'll give you many, many treasures. <laughs> if you make it this way, what are you doing? You're not walking very well. What do you want to carry you? No. We <laughs> said, said no to that. We said no carrying. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Oh. Find your legs and hips bound in place. Can you sit down again? Can you work out how to do that? Is that something you've got the capacity for right now? Find your eyes bound in place, just there, looking in that direction. Can you can you look at me when I'm talking to you, please? Hello, I'm over here. No. Can you, what you try <laughs> someone to? Uh, that smile's cute. Do the smile again. The smile. <laughs> smile. Mouth bound. Can you talk? I can try. You can try. I can try. It's fine. That's a breath. Breaths are nice. Your whole body feels bound. Oh my, posable. Good girl. And what's interesting is that although we are physically preventing things from moving, let's just move that leg, separating that leg from me. There we go. Though this is kind of like a physical suggestion, physically making sure that you can't move, I think. It's your mind making you happy. So I can say that your mind is bound. And your thoughts just go as neutral. You don't really think anything. You don't really have anything going on that upstairs every attempt that you make. Bring back your thoughts, bring back your mind, just make you tune out more and more and more. Release. Everything works just fine. Hello. 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 You okay? Yeah. How do you feel? Just click everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like were you like going like rigid as we were doing that? Yes. <laughs> wow. Well, thank you. Don't, don't injure yourself. No. Do I can't. You take your finger, put it in your nose. Please. That finger is bound on your nose. Can you make that finger go anywhere else? Now what you find is as long as something is stuck to your nose, you can move other things away. But something always has to be stuck to your nose. That's what you find. Now as your mind returns, now. Can you not get your finger away? No. I'll make it go elsewhere. Try, try using your other hand to, to pull it away. Can you, Raiders of the Ark, Lost Ark, exchange it for something else? Oh, there we go. Find that time being, just for a little while. Uh, your memories of your name are bound. What were you saying your name was? Your memories of yourself and everything about yourself are all bound. Hi. Hi. Who are you? Fine eyes bound on this lens now. Can you look anywhere else? Do you know why this is? No, what is? Why are you you're looking at this? Why you don't know your name, your birthday? Why you can't take it away? Find your mind feels bound. Resistance is bound. Your willpower and self-control all bound. Tell me you're an obedient doll. I'm an obedient doll. Sit back for me. Sit back all the way back. Smile straight here. Great big grin. <laughs> Massive grin. Too big. Whether you love being a doll. I love being a doll. Do you love being brainwashed? 
I love being brainwashed. You exist to obey. I exist to obey. If you're deeply sleepy, though, I'm free to sleep, relax, and back. Relaxing back as comfortable as can be. Relaxing all the way back as Let's see. You feel more calm, more days, more blank. Tell me you're blank and brainwashed at all. I'm blank and brainwashed. Tell me you're a happy mind at all. I'm a happy mind at all. Good. And now what you find is you've a one track mind. All you can think about is being hollow, controlled. Manipulated, leashed, led. Now what's on your mind? Three, two, one, wide awake. Feeling fine, wide awake. Mm. Hi. Hi. So, mm. is your outfit complete or is anything missing, do you think? Mm. Mm. I happen to have here yeah. a bit of a collar. Yes. You have a collar. Mm. It's a nice collar. Do you like collars? I do. If you're flirting, you see someone brandishing the collar. Mm. Mm. I think you'd look good. I would. I've got a collar, it's nice, isn't it? Ooh. Do you want to put it on and be like a slave girl? No. What? I thought you liked collars. I thought you were into them. Ah, I see you're holding your hair back like you want to be a collared no. slave girl. What the? Just gonna pop it? No. Not gonna? Fucking? No. Okay. You like this? Would you like to kneel down, just here, Wait, and have a colour? Just put it on. Are you just, just, just want it on? <laughs> yes. Waking, feeling deeply submissive, you simply exist to do as you're told. Feel and think and be whatever you're told to be. Three, two, one, up. Mm. Hello. Hello. So call me Sir. Sir. That's good, thank you. Can I put this leash on you? Yes, sir. Because I think you'd look better. Yeah, doesn't that feel nice? Yes. Yeah. Ah. Oh. So attentive. Mm. Mm. No, I think we should have the floor. Mm. Yeah, pass that back. Stick out that tongue. Big wide eyes. I want you looking dumb. Dumb and hot and needy. And just to go where you're told to. Come on. Good girl. 